Now you see, the business of a sermon is to encourage good behavior and discourage bad behavior. The business of preaching is to show the uncertainty of human greatness. Why you must be upright in dealing with people because the destiny of anyone can suddenly turn around. Preachers are supposed to show you the unhappy consequences of violence and injustice by exposing everything that is bad, like greed, pride, so that people would hate and neglect crime. But this design has been oddly pursued by the church. Preachers now preach with a different view and are gone into other interests. Do I have a problem with organizing shows, music, acting and entertainment in church? No, I don't. In fact, if rightly employed, it is even advantageous to the purpose of turning people for good. But these advantages are now in the hands of actors and entertainers disguised in as preachers. My problem lies chiefly in the fact that the church is now under very dangerous management. The application of the scriptures is pointed the wrong way, which has become intolerable to me. Do I have a problem with church? No, I don't, but I have problem with people of the church. People now clap when the preacher is talking. A sermon is supposed to make people sober and reflect, not to motivate and entertain them. People now engage in illegality to prosper. A preacher is supposed to highlight the grave consequences of sin, not just preaching prosperity. People now feel comfortable with immorality. The church is supposed to unwelcome materialism and indecency, not to ignore them. See people spray money in church, dressing anyhow to church, playing politics in church and doing business in church. People now compete in church. Church is supposed to be a place for everybody, not a place to precinct or tension anybody. Through scripture and evangelism, church molds character. Jesus went about doing good. Impact whoever you come across. It is not by holding crusades at all times when people are walking. Church is the people, not the building. Regardless of criticism, church must stand firmly for truth. Keep these things in mind. Like come your way next time. Remember.